So how old do you want to live to? So do you think older people are uh, lonely? So what is the best age to be according to you, Naveen? Anyways, okay. so what is the right age for marriage, you think, Naveen? Um, yeah, what what do you think about age gap, Naveen? Age gap, see, something. Uh, how are you? I'm all right. What happened? You forgot about the session? No, I didn't. Uh, there was a problem with network. Uh, oh. I'm trying to log in, but it's not connecting. Ah, okay, okay. All right. Anyways, Naveen, uh, this is our second session together, I believe, or this is our first session together. You're absolutely correct. <laughs> it's our second session. Second session. Yes, yes. So, how have you been all these days? Mm, good. Everything all right? Yeah. Mm, yes. Right. How was your day? Yeah, it was an okay day. Nothing interesting, nothing special. What about you? How was your day? Mm, yeah, uh, it's good. Mm -hmm. Fine. So, anyways, today's topic. Did you check the document out for the day? Yeah. Uh, today's topic is age. Yes. Age. Yes. So, how old do you want to live to? Naveen. Obviously, 100 years. 100 years, obviously. No doubt. Yeah. No doubt. I so, what all, what all do you want to achieve by the age of 100? Would you want to achieve by then? Whatever I want to achieve, I want to fulfill that. That's it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Everything. Everything that you can achieve. Yeah, everything. Whatever I want, uh, that one. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, do you think older people are uh, lonely? Do you think older people tend to get lonely and um, they confine to themselves? It depends, you know, um, if old people, yeah, if they are staying with their children and they will not mm -hmm. feel lonely. If, mm -hmm. they, if they are staying with their uh, grandchildren, Mm -hmm. and granddaughter is there will be right mm -hmm. so if they if they stay with children and they will feel uh, very enjoy and like that they will mm -hmm. they will not feel like lonely and mm -hmm. if they you know uh, if they what we call if the old person shifted to the old age home like that mm -hmm. if if they, uh, what we call if their son or a daughter are not mm -hmm. taking care of them that time they will feel like lonely yes that's my opinion yeah, even I think so as well. They tend to feel lonely when they are shifted, when they're not with their children or when they are abandoned and all that. Yes, true. Yes. So what is the best age to be according to you? A teenage. Mm -hmm. And, you know, in between, uh, uh, yeah, teenage. <laughs> Why? Why do you think teenage is the best age to be? Mm, yeah, in teenage, you know, we go uh, uh, college and uh, we have fun with friends. And uh, in in teenage, and especially, uh, we don't have uh, responsibilities. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. our parents will take care of us. And mm -hmm. uh, in in teenage, uh, we don't need to search for a job, and you know, we don't need to take care of our family and. Um, many of the you know many uh, advantages advantages are there to enjoy the life. True, that is true. That is yeah, absolutely you know, true. We can travel uh, along with our friends, and you know what we can love. We can go to the movie. On whatever we uh, we want to do, we can do in teenage. You know, uh, coming to the you know what we call uh, whenever we are growing up, and you know there will be responsibilities and uh, we should take care of our family and uh, mm -hmm. what we call uh, we have to search for job and commitments and yes, commitment all those things will be right so in that's teenage uh, we don't care about anything and whatever we want to do we can do it that is the you're best free, free uh, bird. you're a free teenage. bird yes yeah. it's like free bird yes yeah that is what's true what's your, your opinion on that and uh, yeah, he, for me, yes, I think teenage is good. I think even, I think a, a little younger age, I, I think about uh, a seven, eight years old, I think it's even better. Yeah, T 
teenage we will have our own problems in you know horn hormonal problems fighting with our parents and all that kind of deal so i would i would i would prefer to be even younger than that and that i think childhood would be the best age to be i think okay so you're saying that younger yeah a younger age like a childhood like 7 to 8 years 8 9 like that Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. once you step into that uh, teenage years that's when you start having trouble with things and you tend to uh, you tend to have kind of uh, fights and all that with people around you yeah so yeah that's mm-hmm. the thing it's a bit messy mm. anyways okay. so what is the right age for marriage you think Nami? we call uh, 25 26 mm-hmm. is better for mm-hmm. girls Mm-hmm. For mm-hmm. boys, uh, twenty-eight to thirty. Mm-hmm. Yeah. In between. Really yeah. nice. Yeah, that's the correct age. About twenty-five. I think about twenty-five for boys and girls would be fine. Yeah. About twenty-five. I think yeah. some people tend to be more mature. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That is the correct age. Right. Mm-hmm. So, um, yeah. What What do you think about age gap, Naveen? Age gap. See, age sometimes. Gap. yeah age gap it could be age gap or a generation gap occurs between our parents or between youngsters and you know middle aged people or yeah, even yeah, yeah. between couples what do you think about yes, that age gap matters you know mm-hmm. from my perspective age gap yeah, they, they are very fast and you know what we are the technology and the use mm-hmm. the way of thinking mm-hmm. and and every, everything matter i think so. mm-hmm. everything matters you know they mm-hmm. they that different uh, you know the age gap is matters age gap point. matters yeah age yes. gap matters yeah yes. that's you know what is called you know in a for same age group of people we will uh, whenever we meet and uh, we you know we talk about that uh, same situations and we talk about that uh, same topic and coming to the whenever we meet a person who is uh, younger than us you know whenever we are talking with them you know they feel you know they they will not uh, they will not feel comfortable yeah. with us for comparing right. to the, with their age group of people whenever they they are with uh, their age group uh, people yeah. they they will they feel very free and like that they feel better they feel yeah better yeah that is so that. that's a common behavior isn't it yeah it is it is like that mm, mm. right So um what do you think about um being young always like let's say some people tend to age gracefully yeah what do you think about that statement aging gracefully what what, what do you have to say about that sometimes people when they age they tend to take care of themselves like they tend to work out and they tend to uh, be better versions of themselves yeah so that means they're aging gracefully that means they're aging in a good manner they're not really aging uh, to look like they're old they're actually getting better what do you think about that how can someone age gracefully yeah. aging gracefully means someone who does not age even when they turn older they tend to look young how can okay. someone be like that oh sure now i understand that you know okay. uh, diet and you know uh, you know diet matters and you know mm-hmm. they follow the diet regularly and they mm-hmm. don't eat junk food and mm-hmm. they follow what we call um, they do exercise. exercises and they do morning walk Mm-hmm. run like that if mm-hmm. if we follow and sure uh, we will look very young whenever we you know we get older uh, that time also we look young yeah that is true isn't it like if we follow a strict regimen of uh, dieting yeah, 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 fitness diet and fitness matters yeah. yes that's the thing so i think our session is about to end navin although we only had about 8 minutes of session you talked very well